Okay, hi, I'm Jay Donaker, Mayor of the City of Reedsville, and this is Josh Moorhead, the manager for Pella Manufacturing, which makes the high quality windows that many of us have in our houses. We're here today celebrating a very generous gift from the Pella Corporation in support of our Greenway Blue Ways plan. This plan's been in a place and in effect for over 25 years, but this donation is real, or grant I should say, is really going to kickstart our development of the Greenway Blue Way plan. Our Blue Way plan will extend from Lake Hunt from one end to the other across Lake Reeds and continue down to the river landing that we have to develop with the Dan River Basin down on the Hall River Road. This is a wonderful opportunity to be here today to award this grant to the city of Reedsville. Uh, this project is something that we talked about um, for several months now, and we really feel like this is gonna be something big for the community. And that's something that Pella is really big, is not only coming in to create jobs for people in the area, to take care of our customers, but also give back to the communities in which we operate. And that's just one of the things that I'm happy to be here to do and continue to build this relationship with the city. Well, this is such a generous gift. It really validates the plan that we've put in place over these last couple of decades of making Reedsville a much more, uh, con a, a much, a better place for us to live and work. One of the nice things about Reedsville is we have manufacturers right here in town. So we're still a 10 minute town. You can live here, enjoy living here, and work at a reputable manufacturer without having to run up and down the roads to make a nice living. And we're very proud of being able to live simply, but think big. I just want to thank Josh Moorhead personally for heading this up and bringing this to Reesville. You always have to put a face to a project, and Josh Moorhead has put a very good face to the city of Reesville, to your corporation. We thank you for yeah, that. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Thank, thank you very thank you. much. Yes. Good morning. How's everybody doing this morning? I feel like we need to be doing some jumping jacks to get warm, right? My name's Diane Sawyer. I'm the president and CEO of the Reedsville Chamber of Commerce, and I am doing my favorite thing this morning, which is to celebrate another awesome partnership between chamber members and a big win for Team Reedsville. Um, I'd just like to say welcome to everybody this morning. Thank you so much for coming out on this really cold morning. I'd like to thank all of our uh, state and local elected officials for coming, um, all of our board members and volunteers and just folks who support us, all the city staff. This is a great crowd this morning. Um, we are really excited about this. Um, as you all know, Pella has joined us last year in 2019, and with their creation of over 100 jobs, we have reached over 1,000 new industry jobs in the last three years, and we are really excited about that. I am very happy uh, to be introducing our illustrious Dr. Jay Doniger, our the Reedsville Mayor this morning. Um, but I just want to say before that, the stage um, is full of a lot of great people, and you're going to hear from a lot of great people this morning. And for me, it comes full circle with the Dan River Basin Association and their Executive Director, Tiffany Hayworth, who's also going to be speaking. So this is a really joyous occasion for us, and I just want to say, please make sure that when you are leave here today that you celebrate and that you share the word and that you hit that share button and that like button on Facebook and tell everybody about Team Reedsville and all the great things we have going on. Thank you for coming out. And now I'll turn it over to Dr. Jay Doniger. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Diane. And to follow on what she just said before I make some remarks is when we're finished, you all need to come up here and not only just look at our greenways that laid out, or also to get warm. It's really nice up here. <laughs> I, I said to Diane, I'd been up here 15 minutes sooner if I'd known it was like this. Well, here we are again, celebrating another great industry coming to Reedsville in Rockingham County. It's a good example of our city working with our county to attract an excellent manufacturer. This manufacturer is going to help everybody in the southeast. Anytime a hurricane blows through, you know what they need afterwards, and that is good windows, and that's what Pella represents. And we are very lucky to have a manufacturer of this magnitude, of this 
um, reputation here in Reidsville. I'd just like to read to you what the Pella Corporation CEO, Tim Yagi, wrote about us in the official announcement when they located here. Pella is a 93-year-old family-owned company with a strong brand, a rich history of innovation, and a reputation for quality. We are known for our core values, including total integrity in everything we do, teamwork and respect, and giving back to our communities. After an extensive site selection process, we are confident that the Reedsville community not only has a quality workforce, but is also well aligned with these values and will help us to continue to live up to our reputation as a great place to work. No truer words could have been said about Reedsville and about their corporation. What's behind me here is our Greenway uh, Blue Ways plan, which actually was put into place oh, probably about 1995 by Michael Pierce. And our councils have bought into that over these years. And over a period of years, we are slowly getting to the point where we now have a real good Blue Way and Greenway plan for our, for our citizens here to enjoy, to have a great quality of life, and also to attract other people to our area. This takes time, it takes money, it takes planning, but most importantly, it takes cooperation from a lot of different agencies. We didn't just pull this out of the sky and say, ah, reasonable, we're gonna do this, boom. We did this with getting the right experts, getting the right collaboration from the county, the state, the city, and look what we had to show for it. And then we get a corporation like Pella who looks at us and says, this is a great community, good quality of life, we're gonna locate here. And now they're contributing can you believe it? $30,000 to help push this forward. It, it speaks to all. It's, it speaks to all the effort that many of you in the audience have done, and some of you who aren't here um, to this day to celebrate. And I want to thank that much of what we're doing is based and standing on the shoulders of others that went before us. Michael Pierce, as you know, is, was our uh, city manager for a short bit, and then he, now he's retired. But we're carrying that torch here in Reedsville, and I'm very proud to be part of that. And personally, I, I, I feel really honored to actually be here to accept the check, because there's so many other people that are so much more diver deserving. Thank you. I would like to introduce now. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Uh, yeah, this, uh, getting task oriented here. I can't say enough. We were able to sit down and have lunch with Josh and Leisha uh, on s Friday mm -hmm. uh, with council. And first of all, it's the first time council has ever broke bread with a manager of our um, of a manufacturing site here in the city of Reesville. That's a first. And I think it stands to the again to the quality and values that are being brought to the table by Pella. And I want to thank you number one for taking time out of your busy time schedule as you're getting your plan up and going they're already making windows here anybody wants to ask where are they on that <laughs> they're already doing and they're already hiring more planning to hire more people than what they said there's nothing better than somebody who does more than what they say they're going to do so Joshua thank, thank you. you thank you yes yeah, bear with me the sun's a little bright so good morning team Reidsville Mayor Doniker Reedsville City, um, distinguished guests, most importantly the citizens of Reedsville. Um, I'm ex extremely happy to be here today on behalf of Pella Corporation and the Pella Roll Screen Foundation. It's an honor to be here today. Even though it's chilly, thank you all for coming out and uh, trying to stay warm, and I do recommend coming up here. It's a lot warmer up here than it is out there. Okay, back on May 7th in 2019, Pella Corporation announced the startup of a new facility here in Reedsville. In eight short months, we completely remodeled the facility. If you haven't seen the outside of it, I'd, I'd encourage you to come look at it, and hopefully one day we'll get a chance to show you the inside as well. We brought in, we brought in and set up five state-of-the-art assembly lines, and we've hired over 100 people already, and we still have over 100 more to come. Um, over the next couple of years, we plan to roll out um, everything in the facility and have all the team members up and running. October, we built our first live customer orders. So you think about that, from May 7th to October, we remodeled the facility, hired people, and we built live customer orders. That's amazing. It's just a, a test you to what Pella does, and we, we want to work quickly. Um, we want to be effective in an area when we come in and try to get started as fast as we can. I'm just so proud of our team. Um, they've, they've really bought into what Pella is all about, and they're really eager to learn, and they've just done such a great job getting us started. And every day they're constantly asking me questions. How do we do this? How are we going to get better? 
uh, what's the next stage. So the team has really bought into what we're trying to do and really excited uh, to see all the work that they've done. So keeping with Pella's commitment to serve communities, um, as you heard Tim Yagi talk about, that's one of our primary functions also, is not only to provide work and to provide good jobs for people, we want to take care of the community too. We want to be embedded in with that community and become partners. Um, and um, I'm happy to say that recently we awarded a $30,000 grant, as the mayor just talked about, and that grant's going to fund a part of the Lake Reedsville Greenway Trail, uh, which today offers already three miles, correct? And more to come that we're going to be working on for that. This is a project that people in Reeds will prioritize and one that everyone's going to enjoy and get a chance to go out and just to enjoy the outdoors. And I know that's a big deal in Reedsville is really focus on the outdoors and family. And we're hoping that this project will definitely help with that. So, Mr. Mayor, on behalf of Pella Corporation, the Pella Roll Screen Foundation, I'm happy to present you this giant check. <laughs> not just not just dollar amount, but a big check. Thank you, Lisa, for helping us. You're welcome. Alicia, thank you. You're welcome. For thirty thousand dollars, and I hope this will go a long way to helping that we can't wait to see the project completed. So thank you all for coming out today. Uh, live simply, think big. And now we're going to have final comments from Tiffany Hayworth, the Executive Director for the Dan River Basin Association. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Hopefully, you, can you all hear me if I talk? We got you. Oh, no, all right, even better. All right. Good morning, everyone. I can't imagine a more beautiful morning to be out here um, celebrating this amazing um, gift to the city of Reedsville. I'm with the Dan River Basin Association, and we cover 16 counties over two states, and we protect the water. We promote tourism and economic development through outdoor recreation, and we also, in order to keep this going for generations to come, provide about 10,000 students and youth with environmental education every single year over that region. I am especially proud to be standing here and honored um, in the city of Reedsville because the work that they have done in order to plan for outdoor recreation for their citizens is outstanding and actually quite above and beyond what we see around the rest of the Dan River Basin. And you truly are a model in this community, um, in this region, for outdoor recreation. Um, I celebrate today's a gift to this plan and I hope that the Dan River Basin and the city of Reedsville can work together to see it implemented and all the citizens of the city of Reedsville will be able to enjoy it soon. Thank you. <laughs>